Are you looking to create a custom page in WordPress? Well, keep watching because in this video, I'll show you how you can do exactly that on your WordPress website. Now, before we get started, there are a couple of things you want to make sure that you have downloaded. We will need a text editor to create the page. You can use notepad. That's fine. I'll be using sublime text simply because that's on my computer. You'll also need an FTP to connect to your website and download the page template. I'll be using FileZilla for this. So if you're ready, let's get started. First thing you want to do is go ahead and open up your text editor. And we want to create a new file. And all you need to put in there is this bit of code. This is saying it's PHP. We are naming the template file custom page T1. Now that we've added it, let's go ahead and save it. You can aim it anything you want. You simply want to make sure that you have .php as the ending. Okay, now that we've saved it, we can actually now upload this to our WordPress theme. Just open up your FTP client and you'll want to navigate to your WP-content folder for your theme. Go to the folder, the theme folder that we're using. I am doing 2017 and I will upload that here. Now to see that on our site, let's head over to our WordPress dashboard, go over to pages. I'm going to click add new and scrolling down under page attributes, you see the template and you have the default template. And when you click on the drop down, we also have the custom page T1. Now, if I was actually going to use this template and publish this, when we go to look at the page, you see, there's absolutely nothing on there. And that's because we haven't put anything in there, but it's actually working. So now you just need to tweak it and make it your own. The easiest way to customize a page template is by starting with your themes default page template. So we're going to do that right now. Let's head back over to our FTP client in our list of items. We're looking for a page.php right here. We want to download that to our local desktop folder, go back to our text editor and we want to open that file and this is it. So what we want to do here is we don't want to copy this out. This is the template header and we already have that up here. So we don't want to copy that. Instead, we want to grab this down here and copy all of this. We'll grab that and start a new line. And we'll paste that here. After you paste this in there, go ahead and make sure that you remove this part right here. Now what you'll want to do is change some things out to make it custom for you. Then you can save it and then upload it to your site. And then this becomes your new template. So I'll upload this, overwrite it. And now when I go to my site, and now when I refresh the page, it's pulling in my header and my footer and the area here. Now all you have to do is make the changes that you want to see on the custom template page. And that's the easiest way to create a custom page in WordPress. Did you learn something from today's video? If so, subscribe to our YouTube channel and we'll send more helpful tips to help you manage your WordPress website. And thanks for watching.